Hello and welcome back to another beer review. Now, we're off to Cornwall. We're going to Sharps. Um, haven't done a Sharps beer for a very long time. Um, can't recall. That's going back going back a while, that. I've never seen this one before. Uh, I don't know if it's a new one or I don't know if they've just kind of, you know, started to bottle it and they've been doing it on casks for ages. I don't know. Um, we have a dark ale, and it's uh, Sharps Seven Souls, super smashing great. Look at that, boys and girls! It's coming in at was it five point four percent ABV? There's a the backside, which I shall read to you if you want me to. Um, if you don't want me to, then I'd suggest you just turn it off now because I'm going to read it to you anyway. <laughs> <laughs> seven souls. So seven souls to me. A lot. Oh, I think all the sharp spears are kind of have a nautical theme about them. So I'd say it's something to do with that. Sharp seven souls is named after wild and his its inhospitable, craggy outcrop of the ancient Rump's headland on the rugged North Cornwall coast. So it has got a nautical kind of like theme to it. The rock. Is named in honour of the seven souls who perished there one dark and stormy night. And is in inspiration of our exceptional dark ale. Seven Souls is a full dark ale brewed using the finest speciality malts, a deep and rich beer with coffee, chocolate notes and a perfect bitter sweet finish. Uh, it goes into aromas and taste and finish. Best served chilled, it says. It says a food pairing of oysters, red meats and dark chocolate. Now this caught my eye. It says brewed in Burtonwood in partnership with Molson Coors. Now I don't know where Burtonwood is. If you're from Cornwall, you most probably would know where Burtonwood is. Or if it does exist in Cornwall. But Burton, you know... <laughs> <laughs> Marston's <laughs> you know Burtonwood in partnership with Molson Coors so it must be down there somewhere um, you know coming out with that um, and also does it says something else it doesn't say anything else but then it says a Sharps Brewery in Rock in Cornwall so I don't know whether or not that's been brewed elsewhere Then if you can see that there I'll put it up to the camera Brewed in Burtonwood. See that? And it says at the bottom, Sharps Brewery in Rock. Answers on the postcard, please. I'd like to know where this hell, where the hell is Burtonwood. Um, yeah, so not too sure on that. And also, it's got stuff on the, it says, established 1994. Award-winning portfolio is united by a delicious Moorish character. Brewed with passion, precision and expertise to ensure every drop of beer is as good as the last. Um, and then they're saying we started brewing in rock in 1994 and ambition to brew exceptional beer for the enjoyment of all and we remain committed to this philosophy today so they're brewing in rock then it says brewed in Burtonwood so please let us know I'm interested in that because I don't know where Burtonwood is whether it's Burton you know you know, way you know, Marston's and that. <laughs> There's the crown. Let's see what we get. It smells quite mild, actually. It smells like a. You pick up dark foods, but it smells. A little bit, yeah, a little bit of coffee maybe, not much. Hint of smokeness to it as well. Charcoal comes to mind. So let's put it in the glass. She's come out dark. Just like it says on the label. So the head is off white. Muck that up. Like I normally do. Um, yeah, very dark looking beer. Uh, Off-white head, quite compact as well, if you can see that. Made a muck about that. Let's see what we get from the 
much the same, a little bit of nut as well um, from the aroma. Maybe slight in a licorice, but not much. I'm gonna go in, so cheers. Mmm, I like that. That's nice. Um, slightly dry. Does pull your mouth a bit. Um, there's a little bit of chocolate there. Not much. There's a little bit of coffee there, but not much. It, feel, it does feel a tiny hint of smokiness to it. Which suits it. Um, do get a bit of walnut there. Dates come to mind as well. Um, that type of thing. Very datey. Yeah, dates is a is a pretty accurate description for me. Um, Licorice as well. It's rather nice. It is. It's, if I have anything to criticise this, it's, it's that brooding Burtonwood. Whatever that is. Um, as I live in the north, I'm not that familiar with, you know, you get the Sartre's beers, but I'm not familiar with, you know, the way they brew their beers or where they brew their beers or, you know, um, but all in all, it is a rather nice beer. Um, out of the Sharps Cannon, the only one I weren't too keen on was the Doom Bar. Um, all the others seem okay. This one's okay too. One more for the road. Hmm. Nice smooth texture around the mouth as well. It's definitely a nice beer. Um, so boys and girls, Sharp Seven Souls. Highly recommend that one. Um, pick one up, give it a go. Um, let me know exactly what you think of that. Be intrigued and interested. And um, I'll just see you on my next one. So cheers.